Hey guys, today I'm joined by my friend Keith and he's gonna show us a really cool way how he incorporates a Gatorade bottle with an improvised tourniquet. Let's get to it. What I've done is I've taken the neck, I started out with the neck of a Gatorade bottle and I feed that through there and then that's gonna lock my toggle in place. I went from there to the gate from the Gatorade bottle, which I thought maybe could break, just to a piece of cordage. I thought maybe that would work even better, and it worked just fine, just as well as this did. But then I wanted something multi-purpose, so what I did is I took that same loop and I just put it on my tick key, something I carry with me in the outdoors in case I see a tick on me, and I'll just use that loop as well. So the way it works basically is let's uh, use your arm sure. for, for a demo. So I slide that on before I do anything. That's going to be on the tourniquet. I'm going to take it, tie a knot, and again, this is no substitute for a regular tourniquet. You want to be about two inches above the wound, above the uh, area that's bleeding. And never on a, never never on on a, joint. a joint. Right. Don't ever go on a joint. So if it's close to the joint, go up a little bit higher. Tighten this guy up. All right. So one overhand knot right there. Then I'm going to take a stick you can find on the ground, put that in. Do a secondary overhand knot right on top of that stick and this is where you crank down. You just turn it, turn it, turn it until the bleeding stops. I don't want to go too tight on Allen, but just to show you how you could lock it in at that point, now that's not going to twist back. So you tighten it down until the bleeding stops, lock it in with your little improvised loop. The alternative is tying another piece of cordage around, which people do, or a piece of cloth around there. I just found this easier just to slip it on in the beginning. There you go, guys. I hope you found this information useful. Please consider subscribing by hitting the link down below. And while you're at it, head on over to our Facebook page and follow us there. Thank you for watching. I appreciate your support. And until next time, we'll see you on the trail.